There have been 26 North Carolinians arrested and federally charged in the January 6th Capitol riots. Now, an active duty Camp Lejeune Marine is among them. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Dan Haggerty. And I'm Michelle McConaughey. Investigators say Sergeant Dodge Helenin entered the U.S. Capitol during the insurrection. WRL's Chelsea Donovan has more on who that Marine is and the charges he faces. This is Sergeant Dodge Dale Helenin, pictured on his military access card. And this is Helenin in the blue circle, milling about the Capitol building on January the 6th. Helenin is currently an active duty Marine, according to the Marine Corps. He enlisted in 2017, and he's assigned to the 3rd Marine Raider Support Battalion at Camp Lejeune as a signals intelligence analyst. He's won several medals, including the Good Conduct Medal and the Global War on Terror as a medal. Here he is in 2018 as student of the month on Goodfellow Air Force Base. Now Helenin is facing four federal charges. Newly unsealed documents filed in federal court show Helenin was arrested Wednesday in Jacksonville on four charges, including unlawful entry into the Capitol building and disorderly conduct in a Capitol building. Two other Marines were charged as well. Corporal Micah Coomer and Sergeant Joshua Abate, both stationed in Virginia. According to a complaint, the FBI learned that Coomer posted several pictures on his Instagram page of his self, Abate, and Helen in at the Capitol. Surveillance footage confirmed that the three unlawfully entered the building. Helenin and the two other Marines spent 52 minutes inside on January the 6th, but never took part in the violence. Investigators discovered that while they were inside, the trio placed a red Make America Great Again hat on one of the statues and took photos with it. Helenin is also seen in surveillance images carrying a yellow Don't Tread on Me flag. Chelsea Donovan, WREL News. And the Marine Corps told WREL today that they are aware of an investigation and the allegations. The Marine Corps is fully cooperating with the appropriate authorities in support of the investigation.